my good uh, good viewers a second to get in. You need to add more light over here. Are you good? I think it's good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, the YouTube looks a little dark, but I think I just tilt back, tilt it like that. It's a little better. Okay. Okay. People are starting to notice that we are live. Welcome, 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 one and all. It is dinner time. Yes, it is. Yep, and we got, hey, Angie, what's going on? Sister Angie Z in here. Hi, Angela. Uh, Marcy, good to see you, dear Prince. Hey, how you doing? So Anita's going to, um, Marcy's getting stuff started. What, what you doing, baby? Tell them what you're doing. Celery steak with gravy. Peas and mashed potatoes. Ooh. And you know how potatoes are. You got to get them on first. And yo, Mama Green says she didn't have none of this meat. Really? Because we had. Because we did. Because it says 12 one twenty three, but we had it frozen. So she thinks it's not you know, good even though it's frozen. It was frozen. She said, I'm not going to. I'm not going to have that. Whatever. So she, may, she may have some sides, but. Hey, Mom, can you come out of here and be slick with it? It's because she thinks the meat is not good. Even though we bought it before 12 1 and froze it. Then froze it. And it's a sell by date. Today. But anyhow, that's your mom, Angie. That's your mom. Um, yes, and we Adrian, just love her. Good to see you. So, Mike Johnson, let's get started with the theme because, wait a minute. Uh, well, oh, okay, okay. Let's get started with the theme. Yeah, start with the theme. This girl's gone. She already got to go. I'm just trying to get the potatoes on. Potatoes gotta cook. Um, cleansing brown. Everything's aggravating you. Everything. Everything. That's let's that let's, let's exhale today. <sighs> Think of everything. Put it all in that little ball. Suck it up. Blow it out. Y'all ready? Come on with me. Inhale. Hold it. A little bit longer. Let it go. And shake it off. Shake it off. Let's see what GE Frigidaire has to say. Sharon wants to know what's for dinner. It will be Salisbury steak, mashed potatoes, and peas, and rolls. Okay. The word of the day is, the person you will be in five years depends on the books you read, the foods you eat, the friends and associates, associates you meet, the what? Work the workouts out. you do, the money you invest, the sacrifices you make, act accordingly. Your future self is watching. It's watching. They're watching you. Watching you, your future self. So make a look. Watching. Who you want to be, you better start 
investing and making those moves, all right? Y'all, I can see some amens. I see some amens. Terrence said, yummy. I guess we're in for another big storm starting on Friday in the middle of the week. Who is going to be down your way? Oh, my gosh. What happened? I guess they're getting a big storm where they are. Again. Oh. All right. So, really simple one. So, go, the ingredients hardy to meal. this. Okay. It's going to be a pound of ground beef, mm -hmm. a third of a cup of breadcrumbs, yes. a teaspoon of ketchup. Three. A, no, a tablespoon of ketchup, uh -huh. a teaspoon of Dijon mustard, I love it. a teaspoon of Worcestershire, mm. one egg, yes, one tablespoon of no salt go to, one tablespoon of garlic herb, one okay. teaspoon of onion black pepper, okay. one teaspoon of paprika, one tablespoon of garlic mince, and a fourth of an onion grated. Okay, lovely. So Sounds like it's going to be good. Be about a fourth. Russell Parker said, I'm certified food safety mom. Do you have promises? Okay, I pour her to make sure people. Oh, uh, one away. Young people like you are safe. If I was free to burn, I would not remember him. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Look at this meat. It's that. It's that. Look. It's that. Look. It's definitely not free to burn. It looks uh, good as fresh. Really fresh. As you can see. Boom. But we're gonna do what we gotta do. Okay. Snow in North Carolina. I mean, New York City Saturday. It's snowing. It's going to be snowing snow. tom tomorrow. Mm. We looking for baby. Need help? Okay. 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 Most um Salisbury steaks come has mushrooms. Y'all know I don't like mushrooms. Oh come on. But I did get a can of shiitake mushroom soup. Okay. So when I make the gravy, at least the gravy I have it. I love how you think it. Okay. She said one of her mom's favorite meals, her and her brother used to call a hospital food when they were young. <laughs> no. Wow, they said this had snow in Las Vegas yesterday. I told you, I said I saw it on the news. That's crazy. Last and evil days. Oh, not the evil ones, too. The evil ones. Wow. Hey, Shawana, good to see. How, how did you enjoy the uh, snow, Shawana? I can't even imagine me Las Vegas having snow. Me neither. Remember the last time we were there, it was like 100 and some degrees. I'm telling you. Shawana took us to a, a cookout when we was cooking. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Every dime, how you doing? Yeah, Vegas snow. Isn't that crazy, Dorothy? Byron, what's up, my bubba? How y'all doing? So, um, tomorrow is what, Friday? Yes. I'm going to probably attempt to make uh, something with the pork belly. I think I'm going to um, braise it in the oven in a, in, a, in a little Dutch pan for a while, maybe two, three, four hours and some nice broth and seasonings. Then I'm going to do a risotto. I haven't done a risotto in many years. I think the last time I did a risotto was when I was cooking with my suit on in New Jersey. Oh, wow. That was a long time ago. That was when I had went out with the girls Absolutely. from church. I think I'm going to use the stock from the um, the pork belly to make the risotto. So it's very flavorful, just like the pork belly. Um, and then I don't know if I'm going to put any cheese in it. We'll see. I might add some cheese just because that's normally what they put in there. But I'm going to do that. That means I'm going to do the pork belly probably earlier during the day just to show you guys the stuff I'm throwing in there. Hey, Renee, thank you for creating a star. And then uh, we'll let it go for about three, three and a half hours or so. Okay. So that we can make the pork belly during there. And then I grab some bok choy. I think I'm going to just saute it. Um, make a nice, nice plate again. That is the alleged uh, meal for tomorrow. Hey, uh, S. Ann Giddings, good to see you. You have a, a good recipe with pork belly, belly skin stuff. Okay. Mm, okay. Right. I like it. I like it. We got a star party going on. Let's go, Samantha. Thank you for fifty dollars, Derek. I love deep fried pork belly. Yeah, deep fried is probably good. I do like a sticky pork belly too. I might do a combination of that recipe and the recipe that I'm doing, which is going to be like. We're gonna, we're gonna, I'm going to fill it out after though. You know how I do. Crystal, 
infused glass are good to see you. Here. How here's unique. the garlic. Got okay. the garlic in here. The Worcestershire. Some honey Dijon mustard. Sabrina, we're going to keep your daughter in our prayers. She's having surgery in the morning. Okay. Pray for, we pray for healing. We pray for the doctors. Yes. Plans to be directed. Um, pray for anyone. Health care, um, touch their mind, touch their hearts, and touch their hands. Amen. Amen. Yep. Um, California in the house, Ann Hunter. Hey, how you doing? 59 in Florida. Mmm. Wow. Some garlic. Join that gruyere. They said, what are you using in that bowl that needed a seasoning? I just said, I got, um, I, I just did a tablespoon of no salt go to. A tablespoon of garlic herb, a teaspoon of onion black pepper, and a teaspoon of paprika. You said you put some what's that here sauce. Yes, yeah, so what's, what's your sister sauce? <laughs> what's your sister had sauce. Thank you for fit 500 stars. We're about a quarter way through the star party. Uh, every star it helps us get in there. Um, we That's have the probably mixture three so far. Let me see. That's a little bit. Let me see. That's, That's the mixture. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we're gonna put this in a little bit, right? Hmm? Just a little bit, right? Yeah, because this is only a pound of meat. Okay. 28 degrees in Minneapolis, 37 in Florence, Alabama. Ooh. So that I cook my freezer burn meat with rice from the dogs. Okay, that's a good way not to, yeah. I like to it. To waste it. Yeah. They said we need to whipping up this meal in five seconds. Listen to the okay. chef chat. <laughs> We're gonna mix this up. We're not gonna squeeze the meat because we don't want it to be we packed. Break it up, yeah. Right. We just want to mix the mixture up in it, nice and lightly, yeah, like a mealy kind of uh, texture. Right. Yeah. Just combine it. Definitely. Tampa, Florida, in the house. Good to see you. Shell for real. Good to have you here, Nisi. Sixty-seven. How are you? Thank you for two hundred stars. Stars, victory. We're getting about. Mm, we're about a third of the way up there. Thank you, Daryl, for reminding everybody to share. Um, thank you, guys. Twenty, we got about one minute left in the star party. Let's get at least get halfway on the star party. We're about third way on the stars. Texas in the house. I see you, Debbie. Okay. We'll make a couple of patties. Happy New Year to you, also. Well, that's good. And come Steph Hall, how are you? Linda, thank you so much for sharing. Sharing is caring. You guys know that. Getting all the stove doesn't look like it's gonna overboil. It's, it's, I'm keeping an eye on it. Now I turned it down. It's, it's, it's boiling high, but the downside is coming to get its plate tomorrow. But the um, but the potatoes are, are cut small, so they're gonna cook really fast. Ania, does it call for an egg in the binder? I did. I put okay. an egg in there. I said an egg. Okay, we we, we just missed some stuff. That's all. Uh, Lisa, thank you for a thousand stars. Oh my God, we almost to the star party. We're like 94%, 95%. Wow. Never, I I have never had homemade either. Salisbury steaks. Y'all rich. <laughs> like like Johnson. <laughs> Y'all, we almost made the, par the star party. We're about 95% there. Thank you so much. Sharon Brown, thank you for 50 stars. Oh my God, so close. Happy New Year's. We got second star party achieved. Yeah. Yes. They said the celebration is about to begin. I don't know what's happening, but uh, something, something should happen. Shawana, thank you for a thousand stars. Some some kind of celebration. It says your celebration is about to begin. I don't know what that means, but hopefully y'all saw some sort of celebration. Thank you, Princess Zava, for a hundred stars. You guys made us make a star party. We look. We haven't made a star party in a, in a long years. time. Not a long time. Maybe did we make one? Been, no. It's been a while, babe. Yes. Okay. Laverne, you have a great night. I know you have to go on. Um, Mr. J. Ferguson, good to see you. Thank you for two hundred stars, Sarah. Uh, Mama Green, I told you about Mama Green. <laughs> she in her room. <laughs> she in her room. Uh, thank you so much, Margaret. I think it was Margaret. Um, Latisse, they said, right, you need to be moving. 
Miss J Ferguson. Okay, how are you doing? Regina's vibe. Hey. Gloria Wallace, Sandra Trice. I see Thickness Red in the house. How you doing? Moni X Row. Thank you guys for the stars. Jenny Hollis, thank you so much. So Rita Sykes, thanks for being here. And even Nina's making these things up, y'all. We about to be fancy. I don't know about fancy, but y'all have been, been creating scallops all day. Scallops oh, since the other day. They were really I love that crunchy rice. Yep. It was so good with that. Yeah, I might have to make Mama and Fry's fancy scallops. <laughs> Sharon Brown says, save one of those Salisbury sticks for me, fam. <laughs> so awesome. We had Shawana PJ gave a hundred stars, a thousand stars. Alisa gave a thousand. That's all I can see down the bottom. Okay. It just shows the, the top two on the bottom. Thank you so much, Alisa, and everyone else, too. And Shawana, y'all are the real MVPs. All of y'all are the real MVPs. They said, Dorothy said, old oh, thickness way. I thought she was talking about Nita. <laughs> Nita, you open this for me. Nita, thickness, thickness brown. Thickness Carl real. Let's unscrew the top. Thickness Carl That's what that's what's stripping me. Thickness Carl Uh Francine Hemphill, good to see you again. This is Dita Von T. Good to have you back, girl. Where you been? Dita, I don't remember seeing you in the last couple of lives. You must have a life and stuff. I right, need to run off camera, y'all. Hold on. Cameraman, they want. Well, I'm trying to get the um oil hot. Okay. I'm checking the potatoes. I feel like I need to get over there so people can see what's happening. Come on here. Come on over here. I'm boiling the potatoes. Potatoes look like they're potatoes. And I'm just going to open up a can of peas with a little starch and butter and a little bit of sugar and garlic and pepper. Okay. They want to know what's in the jar you just opened, babe. Oh, this is um garlic. This we got the garlic, garlic oil. <laughs> that we do when we put it in oil. I'm going to take some of this garlic out for the potatoes. Okay. I just couldn't open it because my I'm trying to keep this glove hand on. Dita said she had weddings and had a virus. Oh, I'm glad you didn't come here and give it to us, Dita. I'm glad you didn't put it's it here on this. Way. I'm glad you didn't put it here on this internet. I can't afford to be sick right now. Together. Please keep me and my family in your prayer. I just lost. My baby sister, Sarah, said Aww. October 23rd, and now I lost her brother yesterday. Oh, my Aww. God. I'm sorry to hear that, Sarah. Uh, we pray for, for healing and peace for you and your family right now. Touch your hearts right now. Uh, allow the family to connect even with the loss right now, God. And we ask you to continue to strengthen the bond throughout the family right now, even in this loss, Lord. Strengthen, those, strengthen them during this time of loss. Jesus name, amen. That's crazy. That's mm. sorry to hear that. Are they basically hamburgers smothered in gravy? Mike, what you ain't gonna do is simplify my wife's exactly. meal. <laughs> Mike, corner. corner. My, my, she said, Oh, so glorified hamburgers with gravy. You won't <laughs> uh, feel it in the spirit. You feel it. She feel it, Mike. Watch it, Mike. Mike, so 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 fancy hamburgers and gravy, huh? Always <laughs> That's exactly what Salisbury steak is, though, Mike. Some people just hamburger and flat it, and at least Nita makes it a flavor, a flavor uh, celebration in there. She got stuff in there. Some people just smash down some hamburger out the pack and make some gravy. I've seen it like that. I was like, ain't nothing extra, ain't no love at all in this. I think I should have put another egg in this. If you want, hey. it'll look like it's staying together. It'll, you go ahead, babe. You do your thing. I believe in you. you. Think it'll stay together? I believe as long as you in believe you. Me, I got it. Yep. I believe that we can be in love eternally. I never know. Take this so as far as I can see, you will always be the one. Yes, I flavor my hamburgers before cooking them. When I see people not seasoning their meat, be like, I ate already. <laughs> it get like that, Latisse. It get like that. I'm like, um, you gotta do a little more. Thank you, Shawana, for 500 stars. Oh, this, 
Mike said, don't do me like that, Mr. Derek. We bored. I know. we got the, the guys got to stick together. But come on, Mike. <laughs> Mike, come on, Mike. I got to take up for in her face at least. Then after we can wow. be like. <laughs> you and Mike can go jump off a cliff. <laughs> after I can be like, yeah, man. I know, man. I know, bro. Uh, Daryl said he makes me low burgers. Okay, okay. Patricia said, calm down. A whole song wasn't lit. Patricia always telling me to calm down, man. You calm. You better calm. You know I calms up. I only calms up. That's the only calm I do. Shawana, thank you so much for 200 stars. Oh, my gosh. That's awesome. Appreciate you so much. Dita's feeling better. That's good. Thank you, Thickness Red. Um, she said, I have a wonderful voice. Girl, I wasn't even trying. When I be trying, I sound crazy. What did I actually say? Let's see. My ex used to make meatloaf like that. He would just dump the meat in the pan, stick it in the oven. He was not allowed in the kitchen after that. <laughs> uh, Nat said she loved those pots you're using, Anita. Want to tell them about the pots you're using? They're cooking with greens, brand pots. You can buy them on our, you can buy them on our uh, website. So there you go. Now you know the secret. Cooking with greens, brand products. I use the juice from the, from the peas. Thank you, Shawana, for hundred stars. Some in here. I got a little, about two, add some butter, and I put some garlic pepper in here. Okay. Did y'all hear that pea? No, garlic herb. Garlic herb. Okay. Garlic herb. Now I'm about to stick it back here. One of our favorite dinners no. tonight. Pour out a little gravy for a brother that couldn't be there. Okay, Ron. I got you. <laughs> I smell 120. Uh, that's Rod this time. He said pour out a little gravy for him. Since he can't be here. So when the patties cook, now the patties are not going to be done. I'm just browning them. Okay. Then you're going to kind of stew them in the gravy, right, babe? Yes. Okay. You want me to grab you another plate? Yes. Then I'm going to make the gravy, and then they're going to cook in the gravy. Oh, I hear you. You're making them sound like they're a thang, girl. Hey, Victory, good to see you. No, Gloria, they're not heavy. They're uh, stainless steel... Uh, pots set. It's a nine piece set. Valerie said, Dinner is almost done. It's really nice. I still gotta do potatoes. I gotta make the bread. I gotta finish the meat. I gotta get the gravy together. Let's see. Where are my ingredients? I thought it was. Okay. I'm gonna pick a few of these out. Let's take a little um, garlic butter to put on Oh, so we're gonna do like a little garlic butter toast bread? Yeah. Oh, I love it. With Hawaiian rolls. Ain't nothing wrong. I don't see nothing wrong with it. <clears throat> Digna said, I love when y'all cook. She making me so hungry. Hey, Miss V. Lynn. Good to see you here. Thank you for being here. Thanks for, for following. A lot of people said they have our pot sets and they love them. Love it, love it, love it. Mmm. Are your pots and pans dishwasher safe? Absolutely, absolutely. Our non our nonstick um, pans and our wok are both dishwasher safe, but because they are nonstick, uh, we suggest hand washing them as much as possible. Every ten to fifteen times you use and wash the um, the nonstick pot. I'm sorry, nonstick pans and wok. We suggest that you re-season them. There is a care guide that you get with our with our uh, our cookware, and it'll kind of tell you how to take care of it. Good night, Tamika. Bertha just gonna have some dessert with coffee. Okay, where do we get that, then, Mr. Green? You get them from our website cookingwithgreensfamily.com if you're on Facebook it's pinned on the bottom there cookingwithgreensfamily.com okay oh Facebook's got a new thing it says comments sent on Facebook with 200 stars and more will appear here so there's a little area on the bottom that's pinned 
Oh, cool. Yeah. Got top star senders for this live is Shawana. PJ with 1,800 stars. Elisa with 1,230 stars. Patricia with 500. Renee Peters, Jube with 300. And then Victory with 200. And Sarah with 200. And then Princess Zaba with 100. And Samantha with 50. And Sharon with 50. Thank you all. Y'all are awesome star senders. Thank you. I'm flipping them, guys. Are the knives I see on the website? Yeah, those are our knives. Both sets are on the website. The in, the um, closest set to us is out of stock. We are will be reordering this month. The second set, probably there's only about two or three sets left of those. You can go get them at the on the website. Mr. Derek, can you read my compliment to Miss Anita? I don't like the corner. What? I'm, I, I didn't hear. I didn't see it, man. I missed it. What happened? What happened? I, um, um, I didn't even put him in the corner, so I, he must have put himself in there. Mike Johnson. Uh -oh. <laughs> so I made a little herb butter. It's a little sugar, um, the garlic, herb, and a little salt too. So she That's made a little herb and butter. Oh, and a little herb. So she made a little herb butter to put on the. She's putting them on the top, I guess. Yeah, put them on the top for the um. Lynette says she's never made this, so she's interested in seeing how it looks when done. Okay. Carolyn Punter, good to see you. I see you, Geraldine, good to see you too, Geraldine. I know a lot of Geraldines. Well, I don't know a lot, but I know a couple. And it's the first time I've ever seen the Geraldine. You didn't get how to care for the wok. If you want the wok in the first with the first shipment, um, we were not sending those. And then I was like, after we sold through them so quickly and got them shipped out quickly, I was like, oh snap! I forgot to put the care guides in there. If you need one. Um, let me know. I will. I can email you the. Um, it's actually on the website too. Um, you can download it as a PDF. Um, how to care for our, our pots and pans. Um, we have that on the website. So if you didn't get one, you can you can print it out or you know or let us know. What's up, Larry? Velveeta, Denise, I'm going to try my meatloaf like that. Okay, she said this. She said I'm going to fry my meatloaf from now on. Take that out. Forget about it. What's up, uh, YouTube? How you doing? I see Miss Peggy get in there. How are you? Miss Wendelin Jackson. Lily Robinson, man, how are you? Victory said, can't wait for the next shipment of walks to come in. I know, we we can't either. Like, we would really like them to be here now. <clears throat> They've only been in the U.S. since um, December 15th. That's how long uh, customs has taken. They literally came in the, they, they arrived in the U.S. on Anita's birthday and we're still waiting for them to come here. Okay. BP said he only need three rolls, please. That's it. Can you back up there? Oh, excuse me. She said, I'm in your way. I didn't take out this hamburger. Rhonda said, good evening, fam. Now, what are we discussing? If Salisbury steak is just an elevated smothered hamburger? <laughs> yes. I love all y'all. Oh. Um, yes. <laughs> So the answer to that is uh, yes, yes, it is. Depends on the cook, I guess. And I'm gonna saute some onions. And kadoki. Miss Love in My Life Creek, good to have you here. They said Anita got them numbers up over 700 every time, Lakeisha, mm -hmm. every time. 
Charnette, how are you? Denise wants to know, can she use a, t a, a, a tomato sauce? She ain't trying to do it on gravy. Yes. Yes, you can. I mean, I'm, I'm doing it an easy way because I have some gravy already made. You can always buy our gravy mix. Uh-huh. Because we have that available. I mean, do it chicken parm style. Shoot. Yeah, you can. Put a little piece of mozzarella or provolone on top of it and some sauce and throw them in the oven and broil them. Um, but like Nita said, if you really do not make uh, gravy or you're not great at making it or you hate making it, we have a, a gravy mix that is instant. Um, so you can get this Anita's gravy. Um, and it's also vegan for those that are, are um, vegan. So it's very simple. You just add your broth and our gravy mix. Bring it to a simmer. Whisk it up, and you're done. They say, yummy, I love Salisbury steak with extra onions. Anita loves everything with extra onions. And then, for those who don't know about our um, our gravy, it's only like $2, $2.50 a pack, something like that. Very cheap. What happened to the sliders? <laughs> we changed the mind. That's why, look, that's why you got to check our post in the afternoon to find out if we are still going forward with the meal. Exactly. I know we talk about a lot of things in the morning. We're going to try to start having our um, meals up by the afternoon so you guys know what's happening tonight. You're like, I ain't watching that today. Mike said, try checking with U.S. Customs. I have some things there, and they, uh-oh. You know what? They were holding only for importing fees. No, well, we, because we, we were dealing with a manufacturer. The manufacturer job is to get them to us <clears throat> so they have to deal with uh customs and all that information so they're shipping them from their their uh plant their manufacturing plant overseas to us in the u.s so sometimes it takes a while especially around christmas time so they, I'm, I'm 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 like hounding them believe me I'm, I'm hounding them i just sent them another message this afternoon they won't see it till the night because <clears throat> overseas, the morning is while we're sleeping. So they'll see it tonight. What's up, Mickey? How you doing? Denise Hinton, hello. Do we have to add the cream of chicken soup to the gravy mix? No, no not at all. No, you do not. Not at all. It's just something Nita does. Cook a little bit longer than I'm going to get some of that oil off and get started on the gravy. I need, I need something. Oh, no. I'm in the way? Yeah, I'm right behind you. Okay, let me move up a little bit. We got onions, onion in over here, guys. Thank you all that, that are on, on all platforms. Um, if you're just finding us, take a little second, like our page. Take a little second, follow our page. Take a little second, comment on our page. Um, it won't take any money out of your wallet i'm almost i can almost guarantee you that mm -hmm. um but it will help us out so thank you so much for that ahead of time darling must be at work of course hey gg yeah her, her job's acting up again earlene parrot how are you janice hey where the mushrooms at De derek absolutely i know absolutely Mike, <laughs> thank you, Mike. Thank you, Phyllis. Okay, so these are the potatoes. Okay. Let's see if we need any more salt or anything. Ooh. They good? Very garlicky. Nice. I like it like that. They look, they look good, babe. Let me check on these onions. I'm have a little snap. Hey, Tasha, how are you? So these are perfect. Thank you for your order, LaShonda. It smells so good in here. Back inside. Oh, it smells so good. It smells so good. Goading, Marcia, good to see you. We say what's not coming out, babe? I can't get these up. Oh, okay. Tongs? Oh. No, I got it. I'm 
with a lot of this oil. Oh my God, they said they had to throw away oyster mushrooms because they didn't know what to do with them. Terrible. Throw them away. Terrible. Those are good ones too. Hey, Linda P. B. Anderson. Now. Okay. Sorry, y'all. Give me a second. Getting all my ingredients over this way. Okay. So now I got some beef broth. Uh huh. I got some broth here. Hold up. Okay. Try to take a little bit of burn out. You didn't want that. All right. Got some beef broth. Plate the glaze in the pan. Some Worcestershire. And I got some gravy that I already had. Oh, I got you. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> and I got the soup mix. I stuffed mine with cream cheese, wrapped bacon around them, and baked them. So good. Mm. Who did what to I guess that's, is that the mushrooms? Yeah, it must be the mushrooms. I stuffed mine with cream cheese, wrapped bacon around them, and baked them. Oh, I bet that's good. Ooh, I bet that's good. You sounded hungry. I, it sounded good. I know Mike. Mike Johnson said, Mr. Derek, there's too many Michaels in the world. Please be specific. <laughs> he said, don't throw me in the corner. Uh, he said, need to work on paper plates. Less dishes to wash. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're going to bring this up. Season it. See, it's got pieces of mushroom in this. It was the shiitake mushroom. Cream, cream of cremini and shiitake mushrooms. Oh. See, I did good, honey. Uh, look, I'll take what I can get. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it was really fine in here, so hopefully I don't taste them. I ain't trying to. Let this come to a boil. I'm going to add a little bit more of our seasonings in here. Which you know, one? Everything's been seasoned very nicely. Which one is that, Bubu? Uh, the, the garlic herb. Okay. The herb and no salt goes to. Mm. Whenever I make something, I usually use the same seasonings and everything. And once this combines like I want it to, I'm going to put the meat back in here and let it simmer. Sounds good. Let me make sure this is thick enough. Enough to cover the meat. Right. Come on, stove. Why are you acting up? And I have rolls in the oven. Mm -hmm. And my peas. I'm not doing anything. I'm hungry. This, this is going to be good. No, no, I'm not doing this. Do you have it on? What do you mean? That's not good. That's not working. We need to um, get a whole nother stove. This ain't my house. Sure. Cecile, hey. Well, come on, Cecile. Don't be that way. <laughs> She's been talking to me all night and all she hears. Michael, Michael, Michael. <laughs> Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. I'm sorry, Cecile. Mara, indeed, if you like spice, cut a small jalapeno pepper inside and roast tomatoes. Oh, love it. Love it. Cali girl in the desert, good to have you. Simona, seven forty-seven fifty. Hey, Miss New Orleans in the house. Daryl, what's up, sir? Love you, man. Um, I used to say, hey, my grandpa has a cough like Mama Green. What did she use to help the cough? No. Nothing really helps her cough. I hate no. to, I hate to say that. It really doesn't. I heard it She's tried everything. He really has. Let's try. He's tried. Hold on. Hold on. YouTube's a little blurry. Come on, YouTube. Okay, there we go. Okay, now this is in. I'm supposed to simmer for 10 minutes. Fire roasted tomatoes will be fire on the sliders. You're absolutely correct, Josh. Okay, y'all. I got a whole lot of stuff to clean up. Y'all say hi to Susie, old man. Go. <laughs> I don't want you feeling some kind of way. Okay, now that's working. 
They said they love how you use that that gravy and you hooked it up with the leftover gravy. In other words, yeah. Hey, it's easier that way. Yo, dinner is so dinner in y'all. Everything else is still in there. I gotta check my bread, make sure it's not doing anything. I got a buttload of dishes. I got dishes, baby. Trash. They said Derek can clean up neither. I usually clean up. We do it together. Mm hmm. We do it together. This is no good, but it's hot. I'm not like my husband. I cannot pour oil down the sink. I just can't. You got to do better then, baby. You got to do better. My physical capacity just will not let me do it. You got to do better. <laughs> you got to do better. Hey, Ludell. What's going on? Shirley Brown. Hey, hey, hey. South Cackalack in the house. Glad it's hey. Has Mama Green tried mullein leaf or black tea? No. She tried black tea, but not she mullein. She tried black tea, yeah. They said, Anita, we at 837. Go, hey, Anita. Hey, Good to have you all here. Everyone that's here, that's new, that just kind of found us. Thank you for coming to Cooking with Greens. Uh, we're here every night, every day. This um, is milk. And we usually Pea just. Protein. Pea protein. Yes. So she's showing you guys the milk that we usually drink and using this here as a plant based milk. Believe me, it is just like regular milk. It ain't that almond milk, rice milk, uh, oat milk nonsense, okay? This is just like regular milk. It's made with pea protein, so it's got a very good um, mouthfeel. It does. It's got, it's got a great taste. Um, it feels super fatty. And if you do not like um, plant-based milks, Try a pea protein milk. Not milk is one that we use and ripple. Those are the two that we would recommend. We do not have any endorsements with them. A little bit of sugar. Cecile, come on, Cecile. <laughs> Cecile keeps saying I ain't reading none of her comments. <laughs> Anthony Rolls from from BMO. Good oh, to have you. The timer. How many minutes has that been? I don't like know what two? you I'll do the same. Make sure my meat is Mullen done. leaf. Okay, I'm going to have to look at that. Mullen leaf tea. Because it's supposed to be 160, 165 in the middle, right? Uh, for Yeah, yeah, for, for meat, yeah. So we're going to let that sit for 10 minutes. Mullen leaf. Um, I'm going to remember that because I, I might I have to get people. someone. Uh, well, um, y'all got any questions or anything? Yeah, what y'all want to talk about? I'm going to get the peas a little stiffer. The potatoes are done. The salary steak is cooking, and I'm just browning these rolls and warming them through. Which one drink? Well, I have a little sip of um. Oh yeah, you got a drink. I got a little sip of um, Stella Black over there. I'm gonna. Play Mike, you got to go. I understand, here. brother. You can see the pictures later. Mullen leaf. I'm. I keep saying that in my head, so I don't remember. What's up, Miss Felton? Mullen leaf. <clears throat> it's a tea that they said might help mom. Oh. Okay. For. They say Anita's 30 minute meals. That got faster than me. What about Fair Life Milk? Have you tried it? No. no. Uh, Fair Life Milk is made from what? Regular milk? Because a lot of people have uh, better milks, but there's still dairy milk, and mm -hmm. dairy's really not good for you. I am cooking sloppy joes, one meat, one bacon, and home fries. Tawana, that was one of the things that we thought about doing today. Yes. My son drinks that, but it's still cow milk. Yeah, that that that's a that's. I thought it was a cow milk. I wasn't sure. Derek, how's your picture? You're painting this week. I've already um painted two pictures this week. This is the second one here. I don't know if you've seen it already. <clears throat> and then I did one um, earlier. Well, actually, it ended up being the last one of the uh, of the uh, year, and this was the first one of the year. And I was actually going to paint to last night, but I didn't have any any more um, canvases, so I went and grabbed a couple. Because my wife gave me a Michaels card for uh, not my not not one of you Michaels. This is another Michael we're adding into this the conversation. She gave me a Michaels card for for Christmas. Uh, 
Rachel. Oh, Lord. Rachella Kababy. Girl, with that name, how you doing? How you doing, boo? It says Rachel, a.k.a. Baby. Oh, duh, Derek. <laughs> Somebody said this has been another episode of Anita's Complete Home Cooking in under 60 minutes. Is that Michael Jackson you painted? No, that's Josh. That's not Michael Jackson. Oh, I do have my Michael Jackson. That looks like some guy named Mike Johnson. <laughs> you know, you know, painting is my, uh, my creative outlet. That lets me relax. <clears throat> Mullen Leaf. I'm going to figure that out. I'm going to buy some on Amazon so I have to go look for it. As soon as I remember. Mr. Brandon, go to work, RN. Be safe, please. Yes. Save some lives. I appreciate Good you. Thank, Thank you. For coming yes, I definitely appreciate it. We Designed appreciate by it. Koshi. Good to see you. How are you, Koshi? Welcome. Thank you for um, coming through the Cooking with Greens. If you guys are new here, we have a website, cookingwithgreensfamily.com, where we have our own pots, our own knives, our own utensils, and a line of 36 healthier alternative spice blends, among some other stuff. Yeah. So thank you so much for coming through. Is it chickpea-based milk? No, it's pea. Pea protein, not chickpeas protein. Uh huh. Okay, what we got? Ah, yeah, that's hot. Babe, be careful. You did take it out. Yeah, I got the garlic. Just took it out the oven, boo boo. Oh, hot. Um, very, 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 very good. Um, and also another hack is pea protein ice cream. They have the best. Pea protein ice cream. I'm not saying anything else about about it. If you do not want to do dairy or you trying to find healthier um, ways to eat the things that you're used to, like milk and ice cream, pea protein milk and pea protein ice cream. Uh, and then just thank me later. I know you I know you eat that oat milk stuff and the almond milk ice cream. Hey, look, you're gonna throw that stuff in the garbage. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mike. I'm sorry, Brian. I thought I broke code. I'm sorry, Mike. <laughs> I'm still here. <laughs> Shay Douglas, good to have you. Holly, hey, Holly. Nice Holly. Nicely. Granny Diva, good to see you back. Thank you guys so much. We're going to see this plate go come together. Anita is getting it on, y'all. She getting it on. Linda is having chicken tortellini Alfredo. Nice. Oh, I like that. That's good. I like that. Charlu, good to see you. So we just waiting to make sure the meat's done. Yep, yep. That dirt's thermometer, but here to show me how to use it. Um, just open it. I'm opening it. No, I mean open the thermometer. And then and stick All it right. in the thickest part of the meat. Yep, ma'am. When you're ready. This is 83.5. Making, even on you're making chili, Chris Weimer. This it smells so good in here, y'all. Does it? Oh, it smells so good. Glad to hear that. So I just turned the oven off, so the bread is just sitting in the heat. And I'm waiting for my minutes to be up. So I can make sure I don't kill us. I made the patties not too big, so. Maybe I should check them out. Uh, Pearl Shelton, yes. She said, so the ice cream is better than So Delicious. Yes, it is. Um, so Delicious does do cashew, cashew milk ice cream, which is really good, too. Um, but I tend to like the pea protein. Um, and a very close second would be the um, cashew milk. Ice cream. It said 166. Okay, good then, boo. So I'm good. So yes, ma'am. Dinner's done. Uh huh. What's the time? 650. Ooh, ooh, you got 10 minutes to plate, ma'am. Plates. Gotta do like a uh, chopped. All right, chefs, you should be plating now. <laughs> yeah, mom's, mom's good. 
Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. I'll see you. Have you tried that pea milk and coffee cereal? Yes, Rhonda, I have. We've had it in cereal. We've also had it in coffee. Believe me, you thank me later. That's all I'm gonna say. Thank me later. If you're one of those people that's like, oh man, I love some almond milk. Almond milk is my jam. You're gonna throw that almond milk down the sink. Because you're gonna feel like you eat you really are having regular milk. You're gonna feel wrong. Like, am I getting gas? What's going on? I'm telling you. <laughs> Good old home style cooking. Yep. Yeah, we use it. The only, the only, the only uh, fallback that we still have is heavy cream. But I found a few vegan heavy creams that are dairy free, and I'm gonna be start trying those. But we we kind of keep falling back on heavy cream. We do plant based milk. Um, we the cheeses aren't perfect yet, so we still use regular cheese. I, I said plant based milk. We use plant based milk. We use plant based butter. Um, so as far as the dairy goes, we're cutting back because we do still use some heavy cream. I'm not going to lie to you. I probably should start buying the um, plant-based heavy cream. Give them a try and see. Let you guys know if they're worth it. And then we still use the cheeses because the cheeses aren't 100% yet. Byron said he used to buy regular milk, milk, but then he tried the ripple milk. He never looked back so good. I'm telling you right now. And they come in flavors, too, if you want that, if you have kids. Yeah, they, have, they even have a They have a one. banana one. They have one for kids with extra, like, yeah. vitamins and stuff yeah. in it. They have a chocolate uh, milk one. Mullen leaf. See, I'm, I'm still saying that, Twyla. <laughs> I'm going to keep remembering that one. I'll probably order some on, um, on Amazon once I get off here. There you go. How's that? Oh, that looks good, baby. Mmm, y'all. Mmm, 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 I had to go, um, Negro Spiritual on y'all. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the chocolate one is very delicious. So Country crop plant based whipping cream is so good. Oh, yeah, true. it really is. They said, Okay, Nita, with the plating, you up here showing off on people. Oh, a lot. Look at these people. They want to see my shoes so bad. Uh, they want to see my shoes so bad. Y'all got to stop it with the shoe fetish. Okay. Okay, babe, you better look. She loves. Somebody learning. Somebody learning from me. Roger's Dream Travel. Good to see you. Patricia said, calm down. <laughs> Kim Dylan, you drink oat milk? Believe me. You're gonna you're gonna you're gonna be mad at yourself. You're gonna be mad at yourself. You're gonna be like, man, why was I drinking oat milk all this time? And I could have been having this pea protein milk. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you to be telling you. All right, let me try to see if I can get a good angle for both the cameras. That's a terrible angle. Uh, trying to give you guys a good angle. Hold on, hold on. Boom, how about this? Turn it around. Boom. Let's get my little friends over here so I can see comments. And try it. Well, I thought it was scallops at first. That was yesterday. Was yesterday. We scallop. Miss Green is a natural cooker. Man, look, this, this lady was doing all the cooking before I started deciding I was going to be cooking. Alright, baby, you gonna try right here with me or you gonna try? No, I wanna see you try. Can I see you? Where's YouTube? Yeah, it's YouTube is right there, YouTube. Okay. Okay. Can I see? I think so. We're gonna both. Can you see you? Can I see you? Can you see you first? Ooh, this looks good. First of all, let me get you on. Ooh, right. Once in a while, all the friendly crystals. Shine, shine, shine. No, oh, wait a minute, hold up. I gotta fix Facebook. They got glaucoma right there. Oh, okay, I can just show you. Ah, hi. They got glaucoma. Yeah, yeah, give me, give me some. Bro. Facebook got glaucoma. Hold on, hold on, YouTube. I ain't forget you neither. Oh, Facebook got glaucoma right there, y'all. Right now, as I touch the heel. Look at that. Mm. Heel, Joe. Okay. Yeah. There you go. I taste the carbon. Ooh, 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 ooh. 
Ooh, all right, let's get into it. Let's get into it. Oh, babe, this. Yeah. All right, first of all, the hamburger was just tender as a killer. So, ooh, that's gonna burn the inside of my mouth. I have a string hanging from the inside of my mouth, God. No. Your potatoes are creamy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This thing is good. Gravy is good. Mm hmm. It's hot. Mm hmm. Taste the bread. The bread is hot, too. Be careful. Ooh. That feels hot. Mm hmm. Ready for crystals on that, too? Mm hmm. Mm, good. Mm -hmm. Man, when you grow up, I'm going to marry you. <laughs> this is a nice Thursday night meal. Brought to you by Cooking with Greens. Done in less than an hour. Look at that other piece. And I did everything on camera. Yeah, most of her done in less than an hour, she have like half this stuff done already. So she be tricking y'all. But not do that. Not do that. Mmm. Delicious. Oh my god. So, mmm. It's all thank you too. Good? Yeah, that's that simple. Mmm. Mmm. So, tomorrow, I'm going to do something with your pork belly. And, um, I think I'm going to do a risotto. Because I haven't, and I need to practice my risotto. I haven't done my risotto in a couple of years. Ooh. I haven't done risotto for a couple of years. Once I started doing the orzo, yeah. I stopped doing risotto. So I'm going to do a risotto. I got some arborio rice. I'm going to try them. And the, the idea is I'm going to skim that fat off the um, off the stewing um, liquid for the, um, the pork belly. Oh. And I'm going to use that for my flavoring and my broth for the... It's, gonna, it's either going to work or it's not. I mean, it ain't our first time doing things that didn't work. We're going to do that. But we love y'all, man. Wait a minute. What? Isn't it my son's birthday? Today's the fourth? Yeah. Yes! It's Derek Jr.'s birthday. Wait a minute. Try to call him or not. No. Uh, yeah, we're at work now. We were nice. No, we don't call him. We don't call him. We probably take him out. Um, they said those were pure before we started. Let's see. She right. <laughs> see what I'm saying? She be saving herself 15 minutes and stuff. Doing stuff and... Trying to be the the quick the quick who said that the quick your, who was that your friend uh huh I'm just trying to make sure your, your friend uh huh your okay friend. <laughs> let me hit her up after the show uh, uh, uh. so we love y'all man we love y'all we love you love you we we'll see you in a little bit thank you for all the new people that are here please follow us on all, all platforms cooking with greens on all platforms and not to get special links just search for cooking with greens all platforms all right that's a good comfort meal we love y'all man we'll see you tomorrow make this y'all. Please do. I can even see you. That's my baby. Y'all make them. Y'all, you can you can let people and let let the you let everyone know. Our hearts. Uh huh. In your plate. Uh huh. We'll they, see you in the morning. Oh man, you over I here. forgot to get spinach. For the smoothie. That's okay. We can do um something. We can do a fruit juice. You see how many fruits we got? Okay, maybe we're gonna be making breakfast. I don't know. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Yeah, we might be making breakfast in the morning. I ain't mad. I forgot to get spinach. Do I look bad? I took my eye to the store. Do, do I look? Look. Oh, going it. I can't believe I did that. That's not my my no, not mad. And I, and I specifically said I got to remember to pick up some spinach when I go into the store. Oh well. Anyhow, we love you guys, man. We're gonna eat this delicious meal, and we will see you Very tomorrow. Fun. We love you. Have a good one. Thank you for watching on mm -hmm. YouTube. Y'all are the MVPs I made this with the of Hawaii YouTube. Home.